things we had addressed I wanted uh, you to speak about here in front of this national cable audience is the FBI's new love affair with intelligence cases. Uh, they, they were, you know, when I grew up, they were the G-men investigating bank robberies. And after 9-11, they made this pivot heavily towards the intelligence space. But there's a problem there, Kyle. You know, you can close out a criminal case. There are rules. You got to go in front of a magistrate for an appearance, swear out a search warrant with intelligence cases. It's quite possible you could be an American citizen under investigation by the FBI, not know it, and this could go on in almost perpetuity. Yeah, absolutely. And obviously, we talked about that in the podcast. That is the case. Um, FBI agents have a really good record in front of grand juries. Um, you know, I've got a pretty limited experience, but 100% rate of indictment returning true bills. And I think that's fairly common. Um, the, the investigations that are done on the criminal side are very good and they're wrapped up and they're efficient. That is uh, not the goal, nor is it the aim, and it's certainly not the, the way that they're done on the intelligence side, and this is going to be counterterrorism or counterintelligence. They don't have the same agenda, and they don't have the same purpose. They're not driven by the same metrics. Yeah, and they could go on. I think one of the things, when I was in the Secret Service, we called it a tickle in a case file, where you'd write a report every, say, 30, 90 days, and you'd keep the report going. But, you know, you have, the, you have a line for it in a bureau as well where you keep the intel cases open. Is that padding the file or uh, papering the file? Yeah, that's correct. Papering the file. It's just as long as there's something in there before every file review, which is every 90 days or so, then, uh, you know, the case can stay open. And, you know, you get your gold star for keeping new information added to that case. So it's quite possible there are people out there who have some of these files on them. And because it's not a criminal case with the you know, the disclosure requirements once you get to court and all, you may never know. Um, it's not quite possible. It's absolutely the case. Wow. Wow. That's incredible.